Angela Price from Eden Condensed Small Space Garden Design, and this is Garden Space. Today I'm going to show you how to prune a rose that's in full bloom. Now normally I wouldn't recommend pruning roses while they're in bloom because you, that's the reason why you grow roses is to enjoy the blooms. But in certain circumstances when you've just brought a new rose bush home, for example I have this standard rose and a standard rose is really a rose that's been uh, uh, trained into a tree shape. If you're looking to have a more formal rose garden, um, especially with roses that are standards like this, or if you want to uh, prune your roses into certain shapes, you may need to do some trimming while they're in bloom in order to get the desired shape. Um, now, in a kind of semi or an informal rose garden with standards, I wouldn't mind the shape of this so much, but in a more formal, there's some uh, parts of this that really don't fit with the shape. So the first thing I'm gonna do is actually take off the dead roses and uh, trim those back so that way it'll open the bush up a little bit more and get some of these uh, dead flowers off, which will also encourage additional blooming. And then if there are any pieces that are either coming out from the bottom or sticking out from the side that you don't like, you can go ahead and take those off. There's one down here that I don't like, so I'm gonna pull that off. Do make sure that you're using uh, sharp garden shears and that they're clean. So that way you don't have to worry about transferring any diseases um, from the rose or from your shears to the rose. And then you could just kind of keep going around on this side over here. There's also a piece that's sticking out. So I'm really going to get this down here on the, and then another one down here. And you kind of just want to walk around the rose and see what it looks like and see if you like it. And that may mean taking off some of the blooms. Uh, if you have any other questions on how to prune a rose that's in bloom, please contact me at www.edencondense.com. Thank you very much.